Shout out to that guy who always comments down on my video. Hey, your content sucks. I love you, bro. Honestly, you motivate me every day. <laughs> Welcome back, guys. Oh my God, it's been a freaking long time, guys. Uh, I'm still at home, uh, and, but don't leave, don't leave yet. I, just, I gotta tell you a lot of stuff. I really do. I gotta tell you guys a lot of stuff, but uh, you guys can see I'm in my room, but I'm only here for a short amount of period because I gotta get back to work, but I just wanted to talk to you guys a little bit. First and foremost, guys, I just wanna say thank you guys so much from the bottom of my heart for 2,900 subscribers. We just crossed 2,900 subscribers. It's completely unreal. Um, I, I appreciate every single one of you guys. In today's video, I, I wanna talk about how I got into just cars in general because if you guys look at my channel and scroll down and go all the way through my oldest videos, you will see that my videos were nothing about cars. So how did I end up in cars? And actually, if you guys can go down in the comment section and actually comment down exactly how you guys got into JDM, what inspired you? What the hell? Like, why are you guys buying or spending so much money on cars? Go down in the section down below. Let me know how you got into JDM because I'm really interested how you guys got into JDM cars or customizing your cars, whatever you want to call it. But yeah, without further ado, always make sure to give this a like. It helps me out and it makes me feel good. I'm not going to lie to you guys. Without further said, I got three more days in that job and I can come back home and do the rest of my shit. The diffusers, the calipers, the lights, the side markers. I got so much shit just piled up that I can't do because I'm at school. Here is the story of how I got into JDM car. So sit back, relax. And so initially, I, uh, I started my YouTube channel because I wanted to build something, you know. And as you guys can tell from my older videos, I actually privated a lot of my videos. Um, I didn't know what the fuck I was doing, guys. I didn't know what the hell I was in. I was fucking doing pranks. I was doing fucking vlogs. I was doing fucking baking fucking episodes. I was fucking sweeping episodes. How to beautiful, 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 beautiful Fortnite. Uh, a weatherman. I was doing all sorts of fucking shit. I don't know what the hell I was doing. And I did some car videos, and those videos did great as well. And so I got my Honda, but my Honda was just like, eh, I didn't like it. So I got the G35 Coupe. And if you guys go to my G35, my, when I first got my G35, it is a G35. Let this focus. All right, it's a G35, right? So let's just start off with the cons, right? Let's start off with the cons. Every rim that I have is messed up, so we definitely need to get some new rims. You guys can see, um, it was I was so much happier with the car, even though it was like 10, 15 years older. Like, so I got this G35, and um, I started pretty much trying to customize it. I had a vision in me that I just wanted to do it. And so I did that and I did some videos, but then I stopped and did other kind of videos. And so I kinda, it was it was kinda mixed feelings because initially I'm totally an exotic guy, guy. I was, I want a Lambo, I want a Lambo, and I want a Lambo. That's all I wanted, a Lambo. So I'm still pursuing that Lambo as a matter of fact. But when I got the G35 and I started adding parts and this, it felt so freaking awesome felt like you're building a Lego. You guys can see in my excitement when I got wheels and stuff like that. Let's take a recap. The review. Ooh. Yo, this is huge, yo. I don't even know how to. All right, here we go. So you guys can see I'm super excited, man. It's like building up a Lego and you have a vision. You want to build it. And I intend to do that with more. And once I get a job, I get to do that more because what I did not realize is that these parts are so damn expensive. Especially because everybody wants carbon fiber. You already know. Any piece, uh, if you want a little nail of carbon fiber, that's already $5,000. No, that's jokes aside, like carbon fiber is super expensive. Fender, whatever you want carbon fiber in a car, it's at least $800 or more. Super expensive, but it looks good. And so you gotta work hard for it. And I don't mind, I'm just saying it's pretty expensive. I don't care, I'm, I'm gonna do it. So that's pretty much how I got into JDM cars. You can ask my cousin, I was with my cousin. He's into that, he had a 350Z, he got his car. And I was like, bro, 350Z, are you serious, bro? That's like a jank car, like, bro, come on. You like, Lambo, Ferraris, like, come on. Talk, talk looks serious to me. What, what do you mean a 350Z? This thing is like, what is this? 
But then once I got this G35, I was just like, whoa. My eyes opened and I was just, whoo, like it was crazy. Like a whole new world opened up to me. And so that's why I'm doing, I got freaking lights. I got interior light, a lot of lighting. I like lighting, I don't know if you guys can tell. I got wheels, I got you know splitters, diffusers, whatever. And I'm doing this on, on a college budget, you know, just cause I really like it. And once I get a job, I can hopefully expand my budget and make the car look even better, uh, add some more carbon fiber parts and things like that. But right now I'm just, you know, trying to do the best I can and just because I really enjoy it. And my car's actually sitting out there, you know, collecting some dust uh, I haven't used it in like about a week and I'm just so sad I came home today and I saw my car and I was like god damn I miss that baby so much Jesus Christ I've never missed my car so much ever especially after biking 20 miles I don't know how much I miss my car oh my god I miss it. I'm gonna take it to school today because I really miss it but that's how I got into JDM cars and I've been taking pictures ever since you guys see my Instagram if you haven't followed me on Instagram it's at be distinct underscore all my Instagram is literally my G35. I love it, and I know I I'm I'm new to this YouTube, guys. I'm new to YouTube. I don't I don't know what the hell to film. I literally I don't know, guys. I'm new to this. I'm, I wish I could be daily driven exotics, freaking burning out Lambos and 720s's and all that. I'm I'm trying my best, guys. I'm trying my best, and that that is it is what it is. I wanted to take a shot at it. I'm trying my best and I ain't gonna quit. So that's the thing, that's the best thing I got right now. I ain't gonna quit, it's a mentality. I'm gonna pursue going forward. And shout out to that guy who always comments down on my video. Hey, your content sucks. I love you, bro. Honestly, you motivate me every day. Anyways, without further ado, thank you guys so much for the 2,900 subscriber mark. Appreciate it, let's get to 3,000 strong. And um, love you guys, I'll catch you guys when I come back from work, hopefully with a new installation or something like that. So without further ado, Love you guys, and I'll catch you guys next video. Peace.